healing and the shadows within, embracing the dark side through the 42 ideals of Martin Stoicism. Before I begin, this video is not advocating the use of any dark magic, Mart expressly forbids its use, and that was covered in a previous video, okay? That being said, I will state that in our journey towards healing and personal growth, we often encounter well-meaning advice that can seem paradoxical or even counterintuitive. One such piece of wisdom suggests that we should embrace our dark side, the parts of ourselves that we may have suppressed, denied, or rejected. This notion may initially sound antithetical to the principles of spiritual enlightenment and self-improvement. However, when viewed through the prisms of the 42 ideals of Maut and the teachings of Stoicism, this advice reveals profound depths of wisdom. The 42 ideals of Maut, harmony through truth. In ancient Egyptian mythology, Maut personified the concepts of truth, balance, order, harmony, law, morality, and justice. The 42 ideals associated with Maut served as a moral and ethical code, guiding individuals towards a life of virtue and righteousness. Among these precepts, we find injunctions against engaging in negative behaviors and harboring harmful thoughts or emotions. However, the ultimate goal of Maut was not to eradicate the existence of such impulses, but rather to cultivate awareness, acceptance, and mastery over them. The Stoic path, reason, virtue, and self-mastery. Similarly, the ancient Greek philosophy of Stoicism emphasized the cultivation of virtues such as wisdom, justice, temperance, and courage. The Stoics believed that by living in accordance with reason and embracing the natural order of the universe, one could attain a state of tranquility and equanimity, even in the face of adversity. Central to Stoic thought was the idea that we cannot control external events, but we can control our reactions and responses to them. Embracing the dark side, a path to wholeness. When we consider the advice of embracing our dark side through the lenses of mountain Stoicism, we begin to understand that this process is not about indulging in negative or destructive behaviors, but rather about acknowledging and integrating the parts of ourselves that we may have disowned or suppressed. In the context of Mount, embracing our dark side means recognizing the existence of our negative tendencies, impulses, and emotions, and consciously choosing to align ourselves with the ideals of truth, balance, and harmony. It is about shining a light on the shadows within, not to feed them, but to understand and ultimately transcend them. From a stoic perspective, embracing our dark side is an exercise in self-awareness and self-mastery. By acknowledging the existence of our fears, desires, and irrational impulses, we can develop the virtue of temperance, the ability to exercise moderation and self-control. Furthermore, by facing our inner demons with courage and reason, we can cultivate the wisdom to respond to life's challenges with equanimity and resilience. The Path of Integration and Transformation Ultimately, the act of embracing our dark side is not an end in itself, but rather a crucial step towards integration and transformation. By shining a light on the aspects of ourselves that we have denied or suppressed, we create the opportunity for healing, growth, and genuine self-acceptance. As we journey along this path, we may encounter moments of discomfort, vulnerability, and even pain. However, by holding fast to the ideals of Maut and the principles of Stoicism, we can navigate these challenges with grace, wisdom, and resilience. In conclusion, the advice to embrace our dark side is not a call to indulge in negativity or succumb to our baser impulses. Rather, it is an invitation to embark on a journey of self-discovery, self-acceptance, and ultimately, self-mastery. By integrating the teachings of Maut and Stoicism into this process, we can cultivate the virtues of truth, balance, reason, and equanimity, transforming our shadows into sources of strength and wisdom. For your consideration Kenneth Money April 2024